Welcome to another episode of Millennial Investing Explained. Here's today's question. When you look at those people that post the photos about trading from the beach or you know some fancy pool or things like that that you're talking about, I know exactly what you're referencing. When you look up day trading, you often see gurus with all these really fancy setups and they have really big screens and they have four or five different screens and all these gadgets and things that look really fancy. Are all of those needed to be a successful day trader? And if not, what do you think are the must-haves when you're getting started day trading? I think the must-have that you should have is that you should have at least a computer with a couple of screens. At least for day trading, what I found is, I mean, it's very simple, but at least you need two or three screens. You know, a lot of people showing me, oh, I'm day trading from my smartphone. I mean, you can't really day trade by looking at one small screen on your smartphone and then check Facebook and Instagram and Twitter and then go trade. It just doesn't work that way because day trading is the process of executions of orders really fast, you know, three, five seconds or minutes or something like that. So what I would say is, you know, it just might be very simple, but it really needs a certain screens. When I'm traveling, I have a laptop, but I have three small portable monitor next to me. And I'm always, you know, if I'm in a coffee shop or in a hotel room or something, I open up my laptop, but I just quickly put a couple of small screens with, connected with USB in my laptop so I can actually watch the market a little bit more because I need to have a look on different parts of the market to make sure that I'm actually not missing any good price action and good trading opportunity. But if you're an investor and you have some positions in Apple or other stocks and you just want to you know, check it casually, yeah, you can just look at your phone or just a laptop. But as an active trader, you definitely need more screen plus a good high-speed internet. That's all for this episode of Millennial Investing Explained. Be sure to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook or subscribe to our YouTube channel to get even more free content.